Uh, Nat Wynn joins us live from Rockland to give us a, a shamrock shake and taste you test. You hear me laughing at that? Oh, <laughs> we know that that's not true. <laughs> so we're hanging out here at Zest Kitchen, and if you're wondering why it looks so familiar, it's because if it's your favorite spot, it used to be under a different name. It used to be Bagan, but now they just changed their name, and we're kind of using that as a segue also into you guys are doing a monthly special, like you guys mentioned, shaking things up yeah. with the Shamrock Shake. It's a, sh a different take on the Shamrock Shake. That's what I've been saying all morning. Yeah. So can you tell us a little bit about what goes in it, Angelique? Yes. This is Angelique, the face and the brains behind this location. Hey guys. <laughs> um, yeah, so our Shamrock Shake is a little bit different, although it tastes just as yummy as the maybe not so healthy versions. But um, you know how green smoothies have kind of been the craze yeah. in the last several years? It's a green smoothie, technically. There's mm -hmm. there's spinach in there. But there's also a lot of creaminess coming from cashews and bananas. And the nice, um, the cold, you know, thickness that comes from ice as well. We've also got pure vanilla and um, pure peppermint essential oil. Perfect. Well, you kind of piece that together before we blend it. Why don't you tell us a little bit about the name change? Oh, yeah, sure. So, yeah, I'm basically, I'm one of the two original founders six years ago, an executive chef. So I just recently bought this location from my business partner. So, yeah, so new corporation, new name, Zest Kitchen. I feel like it really embodies what we promote here and what we feel, um, the lifestyle that we promote and what the food tastes like, really zesty and full of life and enthusiasm. So I'm throwing in a little bit of uh, pure vanilla in there and just only three drops of pure peppermint essential oil, which is super good for you. So speaking of the food though, you made this whole spread over here to our left, beautiful and also good for you. Mm -hmm. So yeah. new name, same great taste, right? Yeah, for sure. Yeah, we're just adding things. So we're gonna have a bit of an updated look, some redecorating, gonna have a nice cozy feel and just adding even more fun things to the menu. Perfect, you wanna blend that up? Yeah. So while she's blending that up, I wanna talk a little bit about some of these dishes that uh, she mentioned out to me. Everything is so vibrant and colorful. Um, I know it's probably a little bit hard to hear me. <laughs> But this one grabbed my eye. This is their monthly special cheesecake. And the reason it grabbed my eye is because if you look right in here, do you guys see that? It looks like it might be kiwi, but it's not green. And that's because it's a dragon fruit, which is something that I think people don't use that often, but it's delicious. So it's their monthly special. She changes it out. It's, like, it's a ginger glaze. Is that what you're talking maple about? Ginger glaze on top. Yeah, gingerbread style crust, maple ginger glaze. There's matcha green tea on top. So yeah, we switch out the flavors seasonally every month. Lovely. And then this brownie, she has an award-winning brownie that she made not too long ago, but she changes it up every season. So this is the chocolate brownie with a little bit of fruity kind of uh, glaze on it instead. Yeah. And the drink's finishing up. You're doing the, just the ice and the bananas. And don't worry, I'll taste it for you. But if this drink, I was going to mention, this is called the Golden Warrior. She blended this up earlier for us. If this drink is any indication on how the Shamrock Shake is going to taste, it's going to be amazing because I drank a lot of this already. It was so good. So she's pouring it out. Now, the nice thing about the Shamrock Shake, too, before we go, we're finishing up. It's got a chocolate drizzle on it. So she's going to pour it out. Quite done, oh, yeah. almost. Yeah, the chocolate drizzle is, um, I think, really key because instead of just being like a canned chocolate syrup, it's made from pure maple syrup and uh, raw cacao powder. So super healthy, but it tastes so bad. So bad. Yeah. So, so bad, but so good. So check them out here at their Rockland location. Follow us on Instagram if you don't already, and I'll be sure to show you a picture of the finished product. Oh, I've had it. It's delicious. Oh, look at that. Bridal green. It looks good. Mm. Oh. Cody's already had it, and he gave you a shining really? thumbs up. Yes. Oh, nice. So I'm sure it's going to be fabulous. On that note, I'm ready to go. I'm going to have some shake now. You do that. Bye, I'm telling you. By the way, the food there. So if you're not like, you know, you're saying, oh, I'm not vegan and all this stuff. I'm yeah. telling you, the food there, no matter what your palate is, you will find something there that is delicious. Really? Okay. Yeah, That's really encouraging good. for me. <laughs> we'll be